Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Um, so Lionel dropped the Winner Circles wave of NASCAR Authentics, and it's the and I can't believe Winner Circles was actually back for NASCAR Authentics. So the wave is gonna be a Target exclusive, which kind of sucks, but I know. But uh, let's just move on to the first car. So the first car is Kyle Larson's 2022 HFCars.com Auto Club Raced Win. And I gotta say, I, I love the new package. And I'm so glad they brought, and I'm so glad that Winner Circles brought the cards. So, interesting. So, this is so, an awesome, this is an awesome car. I know some people don't like the car, but I think it's okay. I, the, reason why I say that is because the number placement, like, I wish it was an optional and not, and not permanent. I wish it was optional. But, this is a, honestly a pretty good car for this wave. And I especially love the confetti over here. And I just like Kyle Larson's face right here. When it's, where it's pictured at. So, let's move on to the, oh my gosh. Let's move on to the next car. Next car is Noah Gregson's 2022 Phoenix Race Win car. Not the championship race. The spring race. The spring race. And still, it's a pretty good paint scheme. It's just, the only thing that, the only big downside is the grit, is the flat gray. Like, I wish it was silver instead of just gray. I know it sucked. I just, but, I like the, but it looks looks like his normal car, but with some minor tweaks. I don't know. I don't know. It's just I just found this video off of YouTube. So I really like I really like this paint scheme, but I like the die I like the paint scheme, but that flat gray in this in this car. This is no. This is also the Bass Pro Shops car and the Black Rifle co Coffee car. So let's move on to the next car. Next one is Austin Hills, Austin Hills United Rentals 20, 2022 United Rentals Race Daytona Race Win. And it's a pretty good paint scheme, nonetheless. And I really and I don't understand the hate around Austin Hill. It's just it's just a it just drives me insane that Austin Hill is just, is the most hated driver in the Xfinity series right now. Like I just don't understand the heat around Austin Hill. I really like the I really like this paint scheme. Next one is Zane Smith Love Twenty Twenty Two loves loves Daytona race wind truck. I'm not the big fan of this paint scheme. It's just plain yellow. Like so, do something, do something a bit cool like um like Michael McDowell's Michael McDowell's car. Like what they did to Michael McDowell's car when 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 it was in the Gen Four car, not Gen Four, Gen Gen Six car. And yeah, it's it's a I'm not a big fan of the paint scheme. Speaking of not a big fan of paint schemes, Joe Logano's 2022 Shell Pennzoil Bush Class Race win. I am not. I'm still not a big fan of this paint scheme. I just wish it. I wish it had more design to it, instead of, instead of just having a plain yellow and have red, red, has a red. This is a, honestly a downgrade, but yeah, I'm just it's just a big downgrade. Oh, this is perfect. Austin here, Austin Cindric's 2020, 2022 discount tire Daytona 500 race win, and this is his. This is his, this is, this, is, this was his first start in the two car. I, so Austin Austin Hill has Austin not Austin Hill Austin Cindric has too much confetti on this car. This is the reason why I like this car, and hopefully you'll get go to, go to Target one day and get this car. But right, but as of right now, is as of right now, it it'll be out in uh, it'll be out in November in fall. So the next one is Chase Briscoe's twenty twenty two Manhattan Man Tractors car. For Stuart Hawes Racing, and it's the and it's the Phoenix Race win. 
and it's a and it's a good good die cast, especially with all of this small confetti over here. And it was this was this was Chase this is this is this is Mahina Tractor's first first year as for for sponsoring Chase Briscoe. Honestly, a pretty good paint scheme, nonetheless. Next one is Alex Bowman's 2022 Ally 2022 Ally Las Vegas race win car. And here's some here's some issues. Look at the white is it looks like cream white, and Lionel actually screwed up the white on this so but it they got the they got the render of the car they, they got the first render of the car but then later on but but it was too late to change the white because Lionel Lionel was too late on that anyway I, I, I like the I like the yellow and black confetti all over this car it looks so good and that is Pretty much it for the win for the winner circles wave. So anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like down below, consider subscribing, and with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching this wait watching watch for being with me to review my honest opinions on the winner circles wave of NASCAR and